FIFA 22 team of the season is here and we are kicking it off with a squad builder showdown on the most ridiculous looking card that has come out so far. It is none other than team of the season, Gravenberch. Now, Kerbs, this is of course squad builder showdown and you are going to have to get this man onto full chemistry, which is going to be a bit interesting because he's not from what will be considered the main team of the season from this week because obviously the next week they'll drop the Premier League one and also the EFL one. This week, they've dropped Community and also Eredivisie, but it's the Eredivisie that has given us the most ridiculous... Look at look at that! He's almost got 90 in every stat. It's it's absolutely disgusting, mate. I'm, I'm actually quite annoyed at EA, the fact that they haven't given him 90 defending just so he just looks beautiful 90 every stat. Yeah, come on, you may as well. Like, why? I'm looking at it, right. To give them their dues from his... Future stars, he's got plus three, plus three, plus four, plus three, plus three, plus four. So none of them have gone up five, and it would be five that he needs to get to 90 defendant. So wow. maybe actually our beef should be with Gravenberch and the fact that he's got eight, 68 defendant on his base card. If he had 70, it'd be all 90. Get better at defending Gravenberch, basically. Is what True. However, he does only have one orange stat on his whole in games aggression. Aggression. He's a very nice man, so he's not going to take offence to the fact that I've just told him to get better at defending. Yeah, exactly. Or maybe he will, but he'll just mull it over silently because he's not going to be <laughs> actually aggressive. <laughs> it'll be really sad, but he'll just keep it to himself. <laughs> he'll be like, oh, I can't believe Andy actually just said that. I'll try my hardest. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, Mr. Gravenberch. I do apologise. Anyway, anyway. He's ridiculously good. He's six foot three. He's four star, four star. He's born in 2002. Oof. That even makes me feel old. And I'm a 98 baby. Well, I'm a 93 baby. So I actually am old. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's, he's only like, what? Four years younger than me. So it's not, he's only, oh, he's 20 actually. Wow. Yeah, crazy. He's this good at 20. What? Mad, isn't it? Oof. No wonder buying me didn't want to sign him. Yeah, well, when I was 20, I had a million subs on YouTube, so... Wow, that, that's that's something that neither me or Graven Birch can say. Exactly. To be fair. <laughs> One nil, <Andy>. <laughs> Nah, he's absolutely smashing it. Obviously, I haven't. I mean, I say obviously, I've never actually really watched him play in real life. I think I've seen two games, both of them were Champions League, and he yeah, was yeah, that's what right I mean. I've that, seen him play in the fair. Champions League, but that's yeah, an opposite. Yeah. His car looks crazy. One can only assume that the fact that he's playing in the Champions League and is ridiculously good on FIFA and all of that stuff at the age of 20. Good omens for the fact that he's going to be ridiculous in real life. Mmm. Does make me feel very old. Not as old as FG, though. So that is a positive there. True, yeah, true. Which, in fact, sidetrack, Mr. Kebs. I Ooh. sent you a picture of this. I'm going to tease this to you guys. And I say tease Ooh. as if it's not already up on my channel. Presuming all the videos go up on the days that are planned. Yesterday, Sunday, if this one's going up on Monday. If it's not, shout at me in the comment section and shout at Edit Harry. I did a very different video. Me and FG recorded some IRL content, and we're planning to do this a lot more. So if you're interested in that, go and check it out. And when I say IRL, I don't mean like vlogs or stupid cinnamon challenges and stuff like that. It was Guess Who. But we were playing Guess Who, and it was Guess the Iconic FIFA card. And I can even show you guys the game. So it's the actual Guess Who. But well, there is a sneak peek of the game. So if you want to see me and FG play this, go and check that video out. There was a punishment as well for the loser, where as we were both in person, what we did, Kebs, Ooh, go on. bit sadistic. Okay. The winner got to sign in on my PlayStation to the other person's ultimate team. Oh, God, okay. Oh, no. And put any card in their club in an SPC. Any card at all? Any card at all. Oh, that's brave. Oh, that's very, very brave. So, like, maybe you're Calvert-Lewin or a Richarlison. Oh, Richarlison's long gone, unfortunately. But there was, oh, okay. like, a prime moment. Cantona chilling there. Oh, wow. Because I forgot to sell him. There was a Captain's Ben Yedder. FG's got all of the special city cards. And he's packed most of them, apart from Team of the Year De Bruyne, untradeable himself onto his all-first owner. Oh, that would have been painful for him to get rid of one of those then. <laughs> Make sure you go and check it out. Very good fun, bit of a different video. I think you guys will really like it. And we're hopefully going to be trying to film some IRL stuff on the regular together. So that's exciting. Anyway, Kebs, 
you are also part of the Pro Clubs crew, so we'll do some more Pro Clubs as well. Maybe oh, yeah. get you up for an IRL video as well. But for Absolutely, now, let's do Squabble the Shonen on Graven Bench, mate. What formation would you like to play him in? I would like the 4-3-2-1, please. You may have it. Thank you. I put 4 triple 2 because I thought that would be the easiest to get him onto chemistry. Hmm, okay. Which makes me want to play it myself, but it's... Uh, do I want to play him cam or CDM? Or do I actually want to play him centre mid? Well, that's the thing, because his stats are that good, you can play him literally anywhere yeah, you yeah, like. because you can play him anywhere. Apart from defend, his defending does look pretty bad. Yeah, so true. I maybe wouldn't play him CDM with only 88 defending. Mm. Which formation is he, is he going to suit for your style, mate? I'm going to go... Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go full Jack 54. And I'm going to play 4-3-3-3. Three, three, three. Are you sure that you don't want to play 4 triple 2 did I dodge it? Oh, thank Christ for that. <laughs> because oh, because I God. did. After you said that as well, I was like, oh, because he said that, he might actually go for it, which he could be sick. But no, unfortunately, I have got a 4 triple 2 down, mate. Nice. Yeah. Where do you put? It's basically 4 3 3 4 with everything shifted back a little. So instead of a camp, he's a yes. centre mid. Indeed. That's my logic, anyway. He can run the show from centre mid, his actual position in the middle of the pitch. Okay, this is good. Right. You then have got a striker, left forward, right forward. I do. And I've got a striker, left wing, right wing. Let's get into the first guesses. In we go then, Mr. Kerbs. Like we said, bit of a tricky one. Mm. Getting them onto fault. It's not that tricky. Like, there's loads of good Dutch players. And there's actually now, because of the team of the season and future stars, and there's, act there's quite a lot of good Eredivisie players as well. There are. However, Indeed. I am immediately going to take the easy way out and jump straight in and use Prime Moments Van Basten. Okay. We were talking in the Hullet episodes that we uploaded just as Team of the Season dropped. So if you missed that, more crazy Squabbler showdowns for you. And actually as well, starting to upload some shorts. Harry is prepping them at the moment. And retro Squabbler showdowns that you might have missed if you've only just joined the series and stuff like that. Or maybe you just want to relive but not watch the whole video again. AJ3 Clips. The first one going up is a five minute, six minute version of R9 Ronaldo's prime moment, Squabble the Showdown against Bateson. So go and check that out on AJ Free Clips. And there'll be more of them, more of Eclipse and all good stuff like that going on over there. So go and drop a sub to that channel for more Squabble the Showdown content. Anyway, we were talking in the Hullet one Kerbs about, I didn't know Hullet have won the Ballon d'Or, oh, which is kind of mad. He? I just knew him as like this guy who's crazy on FIFA. Obviously he was actually good in real life as well because he's got an icon, but how good you had to be to get an icon does seem to vary. Yeah, true. I think we've spoken about this before as well, where it was like, what's the, the difference between becoming a, a hero a or hero an icon? icon? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, we had that debate before, right? So I agree. I, he must have won it in like when he was in that Milan side. It was 87 and I can't remember. I don't know how I remember that, but not the club, but that's the thing that I have remembered remember from. Remember from it? Strange. Someone put in the comment section that never mind Hullet winning one Ballon d'Or. Apparently Van Basten won three. Oh, Van Basten was like mental in his time though, right? Man's nine, three Ballon d'Ors and he's 94 rated. Surely that means he should be like 97 be higher, or something maybe. like that. True, I guess so. But then when you look at it as well, should he be the same as like a Maradona or R9? Someone like that. Would you put him on the set? I mean, some people might put him on the same pedestal as those, yeah. right? But I don't know. I can't say I've ever watched Van Basten play. I, I don't play, know. You know? Like, the answer to that. Yeah, 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 I don't really know. But it's interesting. 94 yeah. rated and he will free Ballon d'Ors. Anyway. That is crazy. I would then quite like to try some of the new Team of the Seasons that we're not doing the video on. So I'm going to go for Team of the Season Nabry at right wing. And then I do still need to get another link to... Graven Birch. You do? So on the left-hand side, we'll go Error Divisi. Which one are you going to choose, mate? Oh, that's the question, isn't it? Mm. I'm going to go Tadic and hope you've written Team of the Season Gakpo. Ooh, okay. Tadic is a nice pick, to be fair. How nice. Mm. And you, you are, you're in the 4 3, three third, aren't you, as well? So that's I am. Interesting the way that you're going to have to pan this out. Well, I didn't think that you would use your icon at Striker. Okay. So I went for like a, a little trifecta of Barcelona players. Because I thought what you were going to do is have Memphis Depay up top and then yeah. have two strong links either side with that maybe future stars, Ferran Torres in the Europa League and Sufati next to him. And Smart. then do something jazzy in midfield. But so you can have all three of them, mate. Very nice. Okay. Ooh. 
I'm worried about my options for finishing this team off. I can't lie. <laughs> and I feel like maybe I should have picked... Well, I mean, in hindsight, I could have had Gakpo. And then I could have done Dutch or Eredivisie for left CDM. Whereas now I've just got Eredivisie. And it's a little bit scary. But it's fine. We'll cross that bridge when we come to it. In the meantime, who would you like, Kebs? I would like, mate, as we're doing a Dutch Ajax player, I feel like it would be a bit rude not to have one of the greatest of all time, Mr. Johan Cruyff. So I'd like to have him at striker, please, if that's okay. I'd like to leave. <laughs> <laughs> then on the left, I was looking at it in my club and I was like, do we go for the new team of the season, Gakpo? Or do I go for a card that is a player that's close to my heart, Mr. Tihith Chong, squad foundation player, four star, four star. I don't think I've actually used him on this game. And I feel like, you know what? I might have some other opportunities to use the TOTS card. So I'm going to go for the 88 Tahith Chong. And on the right is a bit of a sticky one. Because there's, I've, I've got a choice of two that I'd like to go for. I do have the David Neres squad foundation card. But that team of the season, Anthony, looks absolutely just amazing, right? But I feel like you have written him down. But... It's a team of the season special. I'm going to risk it for a biscuit. I'd like team of the season Anthony, please, mate. He's so... He looks so good. He does. But... And you can have him. He... Yes! Oh, I, I, I don't like this. Team of the season Anthony. Cruyff. I mean, and... Chong's Chong, guinea. Yeah, but... he, he, he looks quite good, mate. That, to be fair, he's got bundles of pace, great dribbling, good shooting and, and passing as well. Nice and And you've sneaky. never used him? No. No, he's, he's been in my club for God knows how long. But I've never used him, so I was like, ah, great opportunity to do so today. Shame that he's written on my whiteboard, really, then, it, mate, and you still won't be using him? Nah. There's actually... No, there's no way. <laughs> there's no... <laughs> have you actually? I have indeed. I put mm. Chong. Plyvert. Because oh he's on God. both sides. Of course, yeah. And Vegost, in case you thought... I keep writing this down thinking people are going to be funny and be like, ah, I'll use Vegost, you haven't got Richarlison. No one's done it yet. And I keep wasting my guess, but I guess you went for Cruyff anyway, so I was never putting that. Bloody hell. I actually can't believe you've actually written down Chong, not Gakpo. Not Gakpo. Oh, I'm actually fuming. I could have gone double team of the season. Do you know what? Because it's the first team of the season one, I'll give you someone really good. Okay. So, is a goalkeeper. Yep, He's... Um Dutch, 61 rated, plays in the Eredivisie, and he's he's boss. <laughs> For goodness. <laughs> I literally can't be bothered. <laughs> Lovely. Thanks, mate. <laughs> he's boss. <laughs> he's boss him. <laughs> Get him at left wing, lad. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> Fantastic. Thanks, mate. <laughs> Do make myself laugh. <laughs> that was a, to be honest, that was a good one. I, I do rate that because it, it it just works for the Scouse accent as well. It's brilliant. <laughs> Shall we move on to the midfield? Yeah, I think so, mate. Yeah. Into the midfield, then, Mr. Kebs. Who do you want, mate? Ooh, um, for myself, my friend, at right centre mid, I would love to have a Dutch midfielder. A man that uh, used to play in Merseyside, actually. His name is Gini Wijnaldum. So he's the first man that I would like, please, my friend. And on the left, I'm hoping that this man has sort of slipped through the radar, mate. I'd like a man in the Eredivisie. And it's a showdown card as well. I'd like Mario Gertz's showdown plus card, if at all possible. Jazzy. Mm. Very jazzy. Nice balanced little midfield, mate. I like it. I put, as a guest, your on loan United player at left wing or left forward. <laughs> yeah. Thought maybe you'd go for a different on loan United player, so I put Van der Beek. Of course. And you were obsessed with the Barcelona for me, so I put De Jong for you. Ooh. Okay. That's not about bad. as far as my logic went, because basically I had no idea what you were going to do. Yeah. There, there, there was quite a few like different avenues that I could have uh, I could have gone down. So it, yeah, it makes yeah. sense. Fair enough. And that, and that I, would be a player I would love at United as well, actually, because he's un there's unrest in Barcelona, apparently, with him. I mean, Wishful why would... In the nicest way possible, Kerbs, why would anyone go to Man United? Money, currently. There is... The, yeah, okay, yeah, fair enough. Sure. <laughs> That's the only answer I have for you right now, though, because yeah, it's definitely okay. not for footballing reasons, let's be honest, right? Sure. 
<laughs> Fair enough. I mean, obviously loads of players would go to United, but the caliber of players that United fans want to sign. Yeah, very, very difficult to Wouldn't go to, to get United, if that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. It's like, shoot myself in the foot if this actually happens. But Chelsea want Declan Rice. And then all the rumors are also Declan Rice is going to go to Man U. Mm -hmm. And it's like, why on earth would Rice pick Man U yeah, instead yeah. of Chelsea? Like, it's not. Especially like in current environment. Anymore. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, I myself need a Eredivisie left centre mid because I picked Tadic instead of a Dutch one. Because then I could have gone Van der Beek or De Jong or someone like that. Luckily for me, though, I found a very sneaky one in my club that I must have done months ago and never used. I must have just needed an SBC. He's the player of the month from the Eredivisie. And his name is Brauvers. Is that how I'm going to pronounce it? But I have no idea how to say his name. Brewers. Oh, yes. I think I know who you're on about, actually. Yep. Yeah, I know who you're talking about. We'll call him Luke. I th <laughs> nice. I'm going to go I for Luke. I think he I think he was the either the first or the second player of the month, from what I remember. He was only like an 82 rated squad or something like that. The man's got two star weak foot and two star skill moves. No nonsense CDM, mate. He's got one foot and he can't even do a step over with it. <laughs> Sounds like Luke Pingu. But <laughs> he does get me chemistry, so you know, we'll go for him. On the other side, I'll have Tilly so please, Kebs. Ooh, very much out there, mate. Alright, fair enough. I went for your left CDM. I went for Alvarez. I thought mm, Mexican, me sneaky, yeah. Mm, yeah, and obviously double strong links as well, so then you could literally do anything that you want mm -hmm. to left back into your defence. And I went for a German at right, uh, right CDM. I went away from Bayern Munich. I went for Hector, just in case you again went something trying to go a bit more sneaky. So, fair enough. Overthought it, mate. This Tolisso has got very, very cheap with the launch of Team of the Season. The man's mm. in the Hullet Club. Yeah, 90 he's... rated. And he costs 50k. Yeah. It, it's, it's some of the some of the players that you can get now are like it's insane. Crazy. Okay. Still a full squad for me, although my left CDM isn't particularly good for it is still only April. Does feel like it's June or something with Team of the Season coming out, but it's only April still. But he's still not great. But he's better than a goalie, even if goalies are boss. So let's move on to the fullbacks. <laughs> In we go then. I'm trying really hard actually. Sometimes in Squabble Show, I'll just write names down, Kebs, and just hope for the best. It took a so while then, because I'm actually mm. trying to plan your team and like work out what you're going to do. And also, mm. I'm struggling a little bit with mine because, again, should have picked someone Dutch instead of Tadic. But <laughs> all of that has made me forget whose turn it is to go first. So I'll just ask you would you like to go first or second? Uh, I'm pretty sure I went first for the midfielders, mate. So I'll let you go first for the fullbacks. Okay. So, Eredivisie left backs. There's this. Brazilian fella, who I assume must be a objective. He is. He is an objective. Okay, well, I obviously don't. Mauro Jr. He looks mental, to be fair, but I yeah, don't have him. He's an objective. He's also position change as well. His normal is card is a silver cam. What the hell? So it's a weird one, mate. I can't lie. There's Windal, who also looks really, really good. And there's Tagliafico, who's an SBC that I don't have. And then left wing back, there's this Wittick who I assume is a Silver Stars. So again, don't have. It's really biting me in the butt as I continually sniff. I'm, get, you know what, I'm getting mugged off by some flowers, Kebs. It's what's currently happening to me. <laughs> it's my, I get mugged off by grass. So I, I, yeah. I'm in the same boat, mate, if I'm honest. It's not good. So I'm gonna have to go Dutch. And the only other Dutch one apart from Windal is Van Arnholt and he's in the Turkish League. But I'm gonna do it to have hopefully have some players. My left side is not great. And on the other side, I'm going to risk a Mookie Ailey. Ooh, interesting. Okay. Well, I obviously wrote down Vindel oh, for obvious reasons, you know? Yeah. But I didn't think you'd stay in the Bundesliga on the right side. I over okay. overthought it again. I wrote down Klaus because you're also on, on the tangent of uh, going for meme names as well. You would have gone, oh, I'm going to go for that Klaus. It's absolutely right Klaus. Exactly. So I thought, ah, meme name. Really good card as well as headliner, so I thought, ah, why not? It will work, right? What about you? Because I have been putting some thought into this, Kebs. Okay. So I'll be honest with you, it's just confused me more, and I'm thinking maybe I should have just written down two random names, because I'm overthinking it a lot. You are, mate, you are. And honestly, I've, I've actually overthought about it as well, because so in my head, the obvious thing to go for here is Hakimi and Max, 
gets Kem to both um, Wijnaldum, who would, who would need another link eventually, but and then Gertz to Max. It's done. There's plenty of different German left backs I can go for as well. And the same with Wijnaldum. I can maybe go for like a something jazzy that side. But I'll start with my left back. And I'm assuming you've written down a German one. Not a Dutch one from, uh, oh, sorry, not someone from the Eredivisie. And there is quite a few options, but I'm going to play it quite safe. And I'm going to go for Nico Schultz. His ice card, I think. Yeah, his foot, foot versus ice card at left back. And right back, I'm really sort of on the edge of between Klaus and Hakimi. But I feel Hakimi is so... It's painfully obvious that you may not have written him down because of that. And you've gone for Klaus. So on this occasion, my friend, I'm going to risk it for a biscuit and I'm going to go for Hakimi. That is an incredibly large brain of you, Mr. Kebs, because I put Dubois. Yeah. Not Hakimi. Lovely. That's perfect start. And then I got very sad when you were saying you're going to go obvious because I thought you were going to, I was going rum, 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 thinking you were going to go for round. <laughs> My, oh, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Cause he's so rapid. I was gutted because yeah. I didn't put round. I put shoals. No, you haven't. Oh, I should have just gone for tots. Wagner. No. Come on. Oh, I'm tilted. You did put a lot of thought into him. Oh, I should have just gone Max, and then that would have been just absolutely stinky, which would have annoyed you, but it would have meant my team's really good. Overthinking thought it through. Yeah. You've actually ruined me today. Yeah. Oh. I mean, when we decided to do this video, I was like, I put out a community poll on, or like a community post on my YouTube channel, being like, who should we do? People said him, and I was like, for Christ's sake, he's like two million curbs as basically like a competitive FIFA player. Not anymore, mate. Hello, hello. I, wish, I wish I was. Definitely not anymore. <laughs> You've got a goalie up front and a stinky left back. So. Yes, I do. However, the one thing I do say this year, I did beat Captain Tom. He had a full team and I had six Finn Harps players in my team. That's that's my like trophy for FIFA 22. I really want to give you another player, but I'm not, he's got 89 pace, so I'm not going to do it. God. I would like to say... That your that left kind. wing is boss, but your left back is even sicker. Oh my god, is he? <laughs> is but he's got 89 pace, so I can't. I can't give you sicker. Oh man. Oh, and then I could say, yeah, you might have loads of good players, but this guy's the best. But again, he's got 73 pace, so I'm not really sure I want to do that. For goodness sake. There's too many to choose from, mate. There's too many puns available for you to, to have fun with. so many puns. Do you want the same links as you already had? Um, Ideally. yes, please, yes. Okay, you can have Schmelzer then. Schmel oh, my, he, wait, he still plays? Slowly. Yeah, <laughs> yeah very, very slowly, unfortunately. I didn't even know he even existed in the game still. Go on, Schmelzer, lad. Bit of an iconic FIFA player, him, or FIFA cards, I guess. Yeah, because I swear he's been at Dortmund for God knows how many years. You used well, to link so him to Blazikowski, I swear, back in the day. Yes. Big Jacob, or Jacob. But... Yeah, he's really slow now. You can have him. Yeah, thanks, mate. You're welcome. Should we move on? Hey, as well. I believe then, Mr. Kerbs, as you made me go first last time, you are first on the danger zone. Indeed, mate. And I had one or two avenues that I was going to go. I was going to have a look at maybe a German left centre-back to something jazzy at right centre-back that gives me my link to Wijnaldum and then some of the links to both. But the way I'm going to do it, it's nervy times in the Kerbal household because this defence is very obvious, but I might be able to get away with it. I'm going to go for Antonio Rudiger at left centre-back. I'm then going to the red side of Merseyside for Virgil van Dijk. And then I will be going for Halisson in goal. And it all works. Give me all the chem. And I'm very worried because you haven't said a word. Not a word has been said, Mr. Kebs. You sound awfully happy. I wrote down. Oh, no. Collins for a okay. perfect link to Schmelzer. Nice. That's why I went for Schultz because that was going to be my smoke screen. So <laughs> good. I've got one centre half. Lopez in goal. Oh, and Botman. And Botman. Let's go! I should get away with all three. No, Lopez would have linked to Botman Kebs. I didn't write Botman. Oh. 
Oh, no. Nah, you haven't written down Virgil. No. Nah, I put Enray Chan. I put Collins and Chan. They're both yes. perfect. You're such a smelter. You fully got me. Come on. The smoke's great work. Come on. Food. Let's go. Oh, thank God for that. Yes. Lovely, lovely stuff. Now, see, I thought no. I was in a little bit of a rabbit hole. Ho, ho, ho. You are having a... Ooh. I just Ooh. need a Dutch left centre-back. There's actually a lot. Van Dijk. Timber. De Vrij. De Ligt. Macintosh that I don't have. Botman that we've just been talking about. Teze. St. Just. There's actually loads. I'm going to go De Vrij. Okay. And then I could put Handanovic in goal and get a French Bundesliga right centre-back. But... I'm instead going to go for Bastoni and an Italian in goal to give a double strong link to Bastoni. So I'll therefore have upgraded fantasy foot Sirigu. Oh, I was so close. But so far? Ah! Right. But so far? Nope. But so far, Gibbs? <laughs> no, I'm really upset. I thought I had you sussed. I'm so angry. So we put so so you think you're aimed? But so far? No, because I got De Vry. I thought you were gonna go Delict left centre back, De Vry right centre back, and then go for foot captain Handanovic in goal to That's give. That's why I avoided Handanovic. Oh, the, uh, honestly, the, uh, I, th I but thought I, I had you. Lost De Vry. You have lost De Vry. To be fair, I did lose him yesterday. His untradeable foot birthday card, which I really liked. Oh, it's so, untradeable? It is. Oh, I couldn't have used it anyway then. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, he was an SBC. Didn't want him anyway. <laughs> so, at least I've got him at the very least. But as soon as you said De Vry, I was like, I could be on for the triple here. This this, this could That's be nuts. But That's no. That's very sad. You decided to use your head, Andy, and you didn't go with Handanovic or De Vry. I so. didn't go all in on the Delete. one where you could guess multiple of them while still covering the Dutch one. I thought that was silly. Yeah, yeah. So I went for just one Dutch Mm-hmm. Well, at least I'm able to give you a Brands player, which is quite nice. Well, it's very nice for you. Which maybe. is, oh, yeah, you know, I mean, it'd be rude not to use me trump card here as well, you know. What have they got? Is there a Dutch... Ah, I mean, I'm going to be quite kind to you, mate. I'm going to give you a Zoet. Lovely. I'm going to give you a gold player, because I'm feeling nice. Thanks, mate. You're more than welcome. This is going to be very interesting, then. There's a oh. lot of coins on the line. Oh, I don't mind Cruyff and Anthony running at, uh, at Zoet. That's going to be a bit of a boss game, isn't it? Oh, it's going to be boss, I want. Let's get into it. Right, then. I'm scared. Which Cruyff is that, by the way? I didn't ask out of fear. Uh, it's, my, it's my middle untradeable Cruyff, mate. Oh, God. Oh, nah. we've bloody grabbing bear on it. It is, mate. It is. Let's see what he's about. Why do you pass it to your left wing? He's boss. <laughs> I'm going to try and not give the ball to him for that exact reason. Oh, he's offside. Ooh. Right, nice. Oh, 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 oh. Come nice. on, Mookie Ailey. No, why is he so quick? Oh, go on then. Mario Goetze. That's Lovely. Finish in a half. Come on. Okay. on. Do you remember, it's quite funny, actually. Do you remember, I think, this time last year, we did a squad for the showdown on the showdown Mario Goethe, and he was nuts. Or it might have been a flashback, actually. Not good. Oh, no. On there. Oh, oh, I was not expecting you to do that. Nice. How? Oh, Alison. Oh, oh he's he's my hero. So bad on this game as well. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yes! No! Oh, oh for God. That, if... that manual positioning of Rudiger as well. No! Holy moly. <laughs> Beat Alisson, but a centre-back's better than a goalie on this game. <laughs> it's Honestly, it's it is actually better uh... to lose your goalie than lose a centre-back on Scobbler Showdown, just because it's... blocks are so OP. It's mad, isn't it? Oh, no. Block this. Oh, he oh, has what a save, Alisson. <laughs> Go on, boss. Hey, he plays for the badge, mate. You've actually you've given me someone who plays for the badge. I appreciate it. Uh oh. Uh oh. What are you doing? I can't even speak. <laughs> What's he aiming at? He's kicked it straight to Hallison. We take it. We take the the, the small fortune. Oh no. That's Zoet, unfortunately. 
Yep, I mean, you shoot with him if you want. Ooh. Shoot with him? Okay. Oh, no. Hmm. Can Van Basten take a free kick? That's the question. He's got 89 free kick accuracy, you know. That's not even bad. I thought, I thought he was awful. He's got three Ballon d'Ors kebs. <laughs> Very fair point. Three... Oh, okay, that was terrible. <laughs> Definitely weren't getting those Ballon d'Ors for free kicks. Oh, oh that's a ball. red card, ref. That's a red card, ref. I've got Go on, ref send them off. That. You know you want to. You Honestly. know you want to. The talking to at best, ref. Oh, just a yellow. He's, he's booked me for that. Yeah, see, your first free kick was that bad. I well, thought, he's I, I, sacked. Tadic can have a go <laughs> instead. Wow. <laughs> oh. At least Tadic he got knows. it off the floor. True. Can we get a slow mo? It's well? just embarrassing, <laughs> Marion, it really. <laughs> oh, man. Lovely. Into the box. Mario Götze gets him. From what my own at set piece, the amount of goals I concede from set pieces, and I just wanted Zoe to foul him. <laughs> <laughs> but instead, he just so, fell on the floor. <laughs> it, was, it wasn't even a slide tackle, was it? It was just a lie on the floor tackle. There was no slide. <laughs> yeah. Go on then. <gasps> Boss! Oh! No! No! Oh my There's god! No, way. no! What have I just witnessed? No. Oh, that would have been incredible as well! No! Come on, Alden. Ruin Andy's day again. Oh, we have really? ruined Andy's day again. Come on! Yes. Oh, what is Surigu doing? <laughs> what am I doing with my passing now? <laughs> Come on! Oh, Mate, I'm fuming. I, I can't believe what it. What is going on? I can't even pass! I actually, I can't. Oh, go on oh Zoe, you're embarrassing, mate. <laughs> oh, oh my head's gone. No, I bowled it. No, I bowled it. No. I need a breather. <laughs> I, honestly, I, the moment that Boss almost scored that header, your head's head was gone. like, nah, what's head's going gone. on? <laughs> it's actually quite close, unexpected goals as well. Alison, keep me in it, boys. I've got 30 seconds to do some meditation. <laughs> Do some uh, like practice golf swings, mate. Just, just get get yourself get yourself in the mood. Just like, and you're ready to go, mate. You know. Oh well, my that's God, a ping. <laughs> that's a pin, ref. That's a pin as well, ref. Oh my. <laughs> God, I've pressed X out of pure <laughs> tilt and passed it to no one. <laughs> oh, I, I, I won't mention the scream that I just had out of my... <laughs> I think I got jump scared. Oh, my God. I tell you, so we Birch on a booking. <laughs> oh, you're going to score. Oh, oh my save. mate. Jesus. That was a great start to the second half, that. Go on, then. He's Goal offside, side. isn't he? Go on, then. Go on, it's in, it's in, it's in. Yes. Don't this know how he's on. Ruining me. He's, mate, the, I, I don't know what it is. The runs in behind that he makes, like, it's it's just time to perfection every time. He is. That's a beautiful chip as well. Ruining me. No, Anthony. Oh, no. What, oh what God, have I just seen? What, what, oh, my what, God. What was that? That was what so was weird. That? <laughs> that was so weird. Let's have a look. That was, was it, that looked like I don't know. It was the most insane touch ever, or it went through his body. Yeah, that, that, that's what it looked like. I don't, I don't know. Oh, it's only, I've, I've got the replay of the. Uh, I got the replay. It just looked weird. I don't know what it was to be honest with you. Huh. Well, that's just cost me a discard, EA. <laughs> oh my! This is an <laughs> NFL. You're not allowed to block the runners. <laughs> What's what going on? <laughs> no! <laughs> no! How is he going to answer that? No! <laughs> that was unreal, guys. It's like, yeah, no, mate. Sorry, you ain't. Getting, you're not getting that ball. Oh, oh, that's funny. <laughs> Watch melts. Just get it away. Uh, not there, oh, though. Bloody <laughs> hell! <laughs> Meant to head it that's out for a, a decent throw. shot. This napper has come to life in this second half. <gasps> oh, oh, good save. <laughs> No. Yes! Oh, he's got it. No! Ref, it's a minute over! You Come can't on. be doing that! No! We've saved oh. one. 
That, oh, that oh, intricate finally, pass the box was so didn't nice. Ah, oh, fuming. Oh, last kick of the game as well. No! Oh, baby. GG's, my friend. Good get. Oh, mate, Gerta got a hat trick. He did. Oh, he was a boy. Outrageous. What a player. What a man. That Tadic actually seems really good. I know he's not a yeah. team of the season, but he's very, very good. Very strange. It was a crazy game. That was a proper game. We love it. That's how FIFA should be. An absolute mess. A robbery. Carnage. Red card fest. <laughs> no, I mean, yeah, to be fair, yeah. <laughs> how Graven Birch was on the pitch and not a second yellow for that pen. I don't oh, know. Dear. But I'll have, we'll I'll have took one discard going in, to be honest with you, considering I had Zoet. So. Okay, let me just mix this up and then you may fire. That Nabri is very, very good. Mm. Especially when um, Schmelzer started to just disappear. But you had a good game as well, actually, Schmelzer. Go on, it's mixed. Okay. You're in the Jack 54, 4 3 3 3. I am. Um, you know what? I'm going to go for the mean position, left back. I've just moved Van Basten there, for Christ's sake. <laughs> Who was there beforehand? <laughs> Van Arnholt. <laughs> oh, mate. Well. Oh, dear. Deary, deary me. Etani is making a comeback, so he says to scrubble the showdown, and thus wants me to do Raspadori. So I'll use some of Van Basten's rating to do that. I'll be back in a sec. <laughs> Right, there we go then. Van Basten into one of the squads for Raspadori. Cheers, Kebs. I mean, at least it wasn't Graven Birch, it's the silver line, I guess, but it was still like 300k. We've got some packs. I'm not going to open them until Premier League team of the season. Save my mm. luck, hopefully, for then. Get some coins back and start doing some more squad of the showdowns. There'll be one on Fred over on Kebs. Trying to go and check that out. Let's go and check out AJ Free Clips as well. And of course, the Guess Who that I did with FG in real life. All that is available on the YouTubes for you. Thank you very much for watching. See you guys next time.